Hi everyone, Kira Biato here in for another RuneScape video. Um, I have been filling up a little bit today. Um, I did some farming. I started divination. Uh, I can't really remember everything else but we've made a start. And I'm just showing you divination. There's not really much to it. But you do need this skill for other things, so what is it on my eye? And then we do this. I still don't know what the skill's for. It's one of the newest ones. When RuneScape first started, it was just them. Oh, it doesn't tell you when you're when you're a member, but I'd say that one's new. That one's new. That one's new. That one, I'm not sure. That one's... I don't know. But some of them are new. These ones specifically. I think that one. Um, I got my cat out. Looks like I've got to harvest more of them. You can also sell these. As you can tell, for quite a lot. 243 each. So, yeah. Uh, and I changed the title to The Brave. Because the blue I've had before, and I wanted something different. <laughs> Um, but yeah, for that one you need 80 smithing, 80 crafting and 80 divination. So, that will take a while. We went to hide today and um, it was better than staying in anyway. It's been a really nice day outside and really sunny. And it tired the kids out. Gabrielle's not tired though. William is. William's asleep. Gabriella is in her bedroom. She is meant to be going to bed, but she's not asleep yet. <laughs> Can hear her babbling and playing. Oh, have more reward. I'll do the rest of this when I'm not on video. But let's show you the other skill we've not done yet, which is that one. We need to go there. But yeah, it's a pretty skill, but it's boring. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's this way. Or do you start in the one? No. I thought of the second place then, not the first. I was right the first time. Wow, it's glitchy. Let's see if we need to move worlds. Um, that's why. Uh, can we go there? Oh, 
Okay. It's not as glitchy now, so. If it ever does that, you know that you need to change worlds because there's too many people in the one you're in. I'm just going to use this bank chest and put everything in. This is one of the newest skills. It's basically what Tomb Raider does. From anyone that's watched, well, not watched, but played the games or watched the films. I just can't remember the films as much as the games. Um, We'll skill up for a bit on this one. This one's a little bit more interesting than the other ones at least. And there's my cat Felix. I didn't name him. He was already named. Sometimes when you put that in there, it can find things like that. Okay, an old sword was found and an old sword was repaired.
I think William's awake. This video may not last long, as my kids have, well, Gabriella was already awake and William's woken up. The Zerosian Empire's very existence was once the greatest of archaeological mysteries for us to uncover. And we achieved that here at Sentiston. And although the Empire was supposedly sprawling, it was so utterly destroyed that finding a near intact fort buried beneath the sands is cause for celebration. The monolith has a strong connection with something buried deep beneath this fort, however. Was the monolith itself Zerosian? No, surely not. It's beyond ancient. There is only one way to find out what the connection is. We must dig deep at Caridet and discover what lies beneath. Okay. I'll carry the video on as long as I can.
I'd show you the farming one, but it takes so long, so I'm going to wait until I'm a certain level at it, and then go to the certain farming place that isn't as slow at first, and then do the rest off video to do with that skill. I probably will change skills in a minute again. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that so I don't bore everyone. First, we need to take this stuff to the deposit box. I don't know if I'll be able to do it yet, but we'll see. Do some rune crafting. And I think that is it for this video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned and to Lumofos.